This outback Australian town was the site of the first mosque ever built in Australia back in 1861. What's a mosque doing all the way out here in Mari, you may ask? Well, it's all because of the thousands of Afghani and Pakistani cameleers who facilitated and shaped the settlement of outback Australia. And Mari here in outback South Australia was the centre of Afghan activity and is the largest surviving Gan town. Between 1870 and 1920, around about 20,000 camels and about 3,000 cameleers were brought to Australia to explore, ship cargo and lay down tracks for a railroad network that would eventually across the entire country. So the Afghan influence crisscrossed the entire country and the Cameliers played an extraordinarily important and somewhat unacknowledged part of Australia's history. Apart from a few descendants, the feral camels, old ruins and date palms, the main memory of these Cameliers in modern times comes from the name of the actual train line itself, which was originally the Great Northern Railway and ended up being changed to the Afghan Express and in true Australian form was eventually reduced to the GAN. Yeah, fascinating stuff.